Yo, what is up everybody? Welcome back to the channel once again. I'm hitting you with another late night upload. All right, we got the Shonen Jump calendar up here showing all these different potential releases because, you know, the calendar is not necessarily accurate to the date. However, uh, they've clearly got uh, SH Figure Arts, Byakuya Kuchiki listed here for, you know, Bandai Spirits, the Tamashii Nations, all that stuff here in the calendar for Shonen Jump. And I was just briefly like looking to see if anything new popped in here. I check it every now and again just to see because um, I want to see if Yamato for One Piece finally got maybe a uh, you know, date set, but nothing yet. Um, but I do think it's quite interesting that Byakuya is coming. It, and listen, I know you can say that, okay, it's not accurate. The calendar changes. The fact that they listed it here, though, still means eventually it can come. Just maybe not this year. I'm not banking on November because that date can change. But the fact we are getting this man, Byakuya, is crazy. Listen, I've not watched Bleach in its entirety yet. Um, I'm still catching up. But the fact that this guy is coming is hype. All right. Now, we briefly can just look up SH Figure Arts Renji here while we're there. Um, Renji and Ichigo look really nice. Renji looks better in my opinion. I'm, I'm not going to sugarcoat it. Renji looks way better. Facial expressions and all. But listen, with how he's looking, how Ghetto came out from Jujutsu Kaisen, I have no doubt in my mind that Byakuya can be a great release. So I don't know what his current outfit is in um, the Thousand Year Blood War, I think it's what it's called for the latest season. I'm not sure what his current fit is, but whatever it is. I know it's going to be dope, and I'm not sure what other accessories they'll give him, but give him something cool, some cool effect piece or something, but man, I just had to share that really quick because I wasn't expecting to find that on there, and the fact that it's listed here, and it's already got a price, which is interesting, because Tamashi hasn't yet talked about this, so could we get a reveal of him? Because it was weird. That we were getting three reveals for one piece the beginning re reawakening of the line right and for bleach we only got two which was ichiko and renji however i was like eh, they should do three just kind of be as a starter so people have you know different options um so it's interesting you know we got those three characters um i'm hoping if the line can be successful because i really want it to be i really want rukia uh, Yorichi and maybe Soyfun. I, I kind of like her. She's all right. But yeah, those are the characters I want to see. And um, who else? Who else? Who else? Udahara. That's who I also want. But you guys let me know. How do you feel about Byakuya Kuchiki potentially being the third lineup in the Bleach line for SH Figure Arts? Would you pick him up? Uh, what do you hope he would come with? Um, assuming that they're going off of maybe the most recent stuff. What kind of design, if, he, if it's different, um, would you want for him? And yeah, I'm going to end it there. I'm sitting and <laughs> I'm really like shocked at this still. But I'm going to end it there and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Let me know your thoughts down below in the comments. Peace.